back to another vlog. It is currently Friday, June 5th at, let me see here, at 10.23 in the morning. So, I haven't vlogged since like April-ish, well since we got the truck back. Um... That was the last time I actually vlogged, and I wanted to start another vlog because I'm bored, and also I got my second phlebotomy clinic was today, I uh, got grocery shopping today, and I'm going to try to reschedule a little bit, six month shots, so. No, he is eight months, but we're all the uh, cough cough that's been going on. So, I couldn't get him in for his six month shots. So, I've had to wait and wait and wait on that. So, I say, yeah. I am actually just laying here on the bed, playing on the tablet those of you that didn't see my Facebook, Mom and Dad got me a tablet to play on. I'm just basically using it for games. Like, I got one game here that I really absolutely love, and it's this one. Well, give me just a minute, you guys will see. And I've had this thing sent for like three or four days now. So, there's the game. It's called Homicide Squad. Right there where my finger is. And, it's actually an Amazon Fire tablet. So, so when I say Alexa, the thing. See, when I say that, it comes up. But, yeah, I gotta get ready for phlebotomy clinicals. And then I'm going to call the doctor again, reschedule his appointment, and then I will see you guys in a little while. Another part of the vlog is currently 317. I am out of phlebotomy clinicals. Short shit stuck me twice, which you guys can see the other one right there. I stuck her twice. Yeah. And we got more things to practice with. We got butterfly needles and everything, so <laughs> we got a whole baggie to actually practice with this time. And then on our way home, we actually stopped at Vapor. What do we call Vapor? And we actually got some more vape. I got this one. It's a smock. 
smoke and it looks like this. Sorry if you guys can barely hear me. I feel like I'm having to shout. But this is that one. Mine's the splatter. Babes is the snake skin pattern. And this is what it looks like. It's better than the Views Alto. It's like much better. I can't really pull that out. The pods on these are bigger. So you guys can see. Like that. There's his. And then mine looks like this. And then we also got, for the juice, we got the Fireball uh, Vape Juice. So, that's what it looks like. So. See how we're just heading home, then we're going to be going grocery shopping. So, so yeah, I will see you guys in just a little bit. Okay, so another part of the vlog, it is currently 5.31 in the afternoon. Uh, we're fixing to go grocery shopping now, but we're heading to Mom's. Then we're going grocery shopping. But we just now checked the mail at the house, and something actually came in today, which I'm really happy about. And... That would happen to be, let me cover up the address, well, my address, that would have to be my state test results. I'm not going to read it to you guys, I'm just going to hold it up and show you. Huh? I ain't going to read it to you guys just yet, but I'm just going to show you guys that it is actually from the state test place so as you guys can see it says Kentucky nurse aid registry and do you just want to go ahead and say it honey no. Not yet. or do you want to get mom's reaction in there She passed her state test. I passed my state test. So, you guys, you guys can see right there what it says. I'll try to hold it as still as I can for you guys. And if you guys want to, you can pause it right here and read it. But my status is active. And it expire, expires on May 31st, 2022. So. So, yeah. I am pretty much. Oh, I just put. I am pretty much a registered nurse, almost. I'm actually a CNA. Right now. Certified nursing assistant. Which is for the nursing home stuff like that but yeah we are almost at mom's we are almost at mom's now like I just now said before my finger hit the pause button but I will see you guys back in just a little while Expires on the 31st of May the 22nd. 
not listed on the Kentucky Nurses Aid Abuse Registry to maintain an active status on the Nurses Aid Registry you must provide proof of a minimum of eight hours of employment for pay in the nursing or nurses related <coughs> service for a 24, 24 month period two months before that date your active status ends you will receive a letter from the Kentucky Nurses Aid Registry asking you to send the appropriate proof of employment notify this office of any changes in your name that you will receive notification in timely manner you may also change your name and address on your website at http semicolon double backlash kbn dot ky dot row She's a nurse, Dan. I passed my state test. <laughs> Good. She's a certified CNA. Oh, how's it feel like being a nurse? Odd. But you know, that's why she wouldn't read it. Me and AJ did. AJ goes, does that say what I think it says? I'm like, yeah, it does. <laughs> he tapped me on the shower and goes, yay! <laughs> Oh, you're a professional uh, nurse today now. In other words, I can get a job at the nursing home right now. Yay! Good afternoon or morning or whatever you guys want to say, but it is currently Saturday, June 6th at 12.01. So, we are just fixing ready to go to town because I forgot some things yesterday. Huh? And we are in the van. Yeah, and we are in the van, as you guys can see. Because we are going to, like, kind of park the truck for a little while until we start heading out for Florida. That's the way it won't put that many miles on it. Because it's already got, what, like 160-some thousand? 460. 161,000 miles on the, on the truck and when we got it back it had 156 it had 156,000 miles on it and we've got it back since April yeah look how many trips to Ohio pot moms what three four times to the college oh. well once for state testing twice for clinicals Oh, and I will insert a clip right here of Tuesday's clinicals of me actually drawing somebody in our classmates' blood. So, I will insert that right here. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that little clip of me drawing somebody's blood. Yesterday didn't really go too well. I kind of failed yesterday at draw blood, but it's okay. We're practicing. I'm not professional yet. The day got turned around. Yeah, the day did get turned around as you guys saw yesterday that I did pass my nursing aid state test. So, I am actually certified as a SRNA. Sorry if you guys can barely hear. It's the wind. Um, I forgot what else I was going to say. Okay, there is 
something else I want to tell you guys that we've actually been kind of keeping secret. But for those of the people that seen us in town, Grace and wherever, we got to take the truck to the body shop on Monday. The reason why? Him and Desi had an accident on May 12th. Go fishing. So, some old woman poured out in front of him and he couldn't get stopped. So, he deboned her and he called me. And when he called me, he was like, I told him to turn up. I was like, no. So, we actually got all that paperwork and everything done. So, we're getting the truck fixed Monday. So, we, we will be dealing without the truck for a week. That is also the reason why we're leaving the truck parked. Because we want to have enough gas in it for when we take it to the body shop. I also want to start driving the van again. Because we ain't really drove the van. Yeah, we drove the van only three times since we got the truck back. And that was the other day to Sky Lake. Uh, what, the other day to mom? Yeah, and we'll take Desi up from the hospital. Because Desi got a little bit on the injured side. Not too bad, but she just got a little bruise. The seatbelt bruise. What was it? Her neck? Her ribs? Her back? Pretty much like whiplash. <laughs> but she was bruised. She's okay now. She's hyper. Hyper as ever. Like I said, we're just going to town. We ain't going that far today. I got a big car mechanic. Which. I think I got like one can left in the truck. What the hell? Is this guy an idiot? Probably. But. Yeah, that's what we're doing. I'm going to pick mom up a can of backer, like I said. And I want to get a few more things that I forgot last night. So, that's what we are doing, actually. And then, probably later. Yeah, I will do it before and after of the truck. I'll do a little bit of a walk around of the truck. Probably tomorrow. Because I gotta clean out the pool today. I gotta get laundry done. I gotta put dishes away. Huh? We gotta get everything ready to go to Florida, so I gotta get um, all of mine and the baby's clothes picked out and stuff. He's got to get his clothes picked out. Vado's got to get all his clothes picked out that he wants to take. So, so we're going to be pretty much busy. And the way I'm taking it is July 1st, we're all going to be going back to work. So, so that's the way I'm taking it. We're all supposed to be going back to work. But I don't know. Let's we'll have to wait and see. But I will see you guys in just a little bit. I'm gonna do like a road clip and then I'll see you guys.
Good morning, everyone. So it is currently Thursday, June eleventh, and it is twelve thirty-two in the afternoon. I just now woke up, so I am still sleepy, but oh, the other day when I last talked to you guys, we took the truck to the garage, which was Monday. And I ain't filmed since then because we've been out in the pool like every day since Monday. I got a sunburn on my arm right here, but it's about, it's already gone to tan, but we are supposed to go pick up the truck today. Hoping and praying we actually do. So, just woke up, babe's gonna check the mail. So yeah, that is all I'm doing right now. I literally gotta go pee, but I'm too lazy to get up. So, if we do go get the truck at 3 o'clock, I will see you guys on our way. So, it is currently now, what time is it? 128 we are pumping the tire up on the van so we can actually go get the truck you want to say where she's at body shop we had a facelift yeah where's she at right now we just seen her oh she's sitting outside ready to go yeah we're fixing to go pick her up so i'll go pick my bitch up your ding, the ding, ding, ding is going off. But yeah, that's what we are doing right now. I was going to do a before and after little clip of before the truck went to the body shop and then after. But I didn't get to in time, so I just said fooey with it. So, yeah. You want to say hi? Hi. So, yeah, it's what we are doing right now. <laughs> but yeah, I guess I will see you guys when we get to the body shop and actually get her back. More. And your bottle's not leaking. They put, they put some more. It must just been some water in there. They, 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 top, they topped it off there. And it's yeah, they're going to bomb somebody. So anyway, it's just as soon as they get them, we'll snap that grill in there and we'll take 15. Currently 3.53 and now the truck is completely done. We are now officially going to go get the truck. I'm excited. And you, honey? <laughs> no. Nope. I am too. I've been sitting a mile away for the past hour. <laughs> so, yeah, we're heading there now. Well, what do you think, honey? Look at the fender. You can tell that paint is fresh. Uh -huh. 
Start it. I want to get to start. It is 5.54 now. I am putting the dash thingies for the truck in here now. So, that is what I am doing right now. Oh, I don't know if I should place mine on the windshield or where. And he's checking the fuses for this other cigarette water over here so we can have two chargers two cigarette port things one for the GPS and the other one for the phones and stuff okay Hello everyone and good afternoon, evening, whatever you guys want to call it. So it is Sunday, June 14th at 3.58 in the evening or afternoon. We are actually almost done packing for tomorrow. And I got my phlebotomy state exam at 1 o'clock to 3 o'clock tomorrow. And then after my phlebotomy exam, we are heading out to go to Florida, like we've been talking about for the last couple of videos. So we are both really excited, and this thing is kind of not going to stay today. Okay, the other day it went so wobbly. Today it's really wobbly. Sorry about the wobbling, but this thing ain't wanting to cooperate today. But right now, me and him just just going to town to get me a can of backer and pick up some more supplies and actually get something to drink because I'm wanting caffeine today. I ain't had a chew since, what? Last night? Like, what? No, it wasn't even last night. It was before we was at mom's yesterday. I ain't had a chew since probably four o'clock yesterday afternoon. And I ain't had caffeine since yesterday, so. I'm kind of a grouch this morning. And we've only been awake since. Really? like 12. We've only been awake since like 12 o'clock and it's already 4 o'clock so. So I'm gonna make more CDs. We got everything just about packed. We got everything just about packed. The only thing we still like to pack left is like the electronics. Like like I said, the electronics, um, little bits and clothes, and that's pretty much it. And except for like his fishing poles and stuff that he's gonna bring, if he still brings them, you are still bringing them. Just don't know if we have time to fish. Oh, and that did remind me. Hang on. I bought some things at Walmart yesterday. Okay, so the first thing I bought at Walmart was a tarp so we can put over the bed of the truck. So, the, like the fishing poles, what else? 
our clothes won't get wet and whatever else we're taking down there. If it rains. Especially if it rains because it's sprinkling right now. So it's the eight foot by ten foot tarp. This was what? Eight dollars six or eight dollars at Walmart yesterday. So there's that thing. And then here is some other things I got. I forgot to do this last night, but I just took this off. So the first thing I got is a selfie stick so I can vlog a little bit on the beach. And actually, I think this one is like the Bluetooth one, but I don't know, honestly, because it looks like the one I ordered a long time ago off eBay that was Bluetooth. So, I mean, this was only four dollars, so. so I have something to vlog on the beach instead of holding the phone. And then I got a waterproof, water-resistant pouch for when and if we take the jet skis out. Yeah, it's going to be when we take the jet skis out. So I can actually put my phone, Babe's phone, and hopefully Asshole's phone in here too. So it won't get wet. And this was like $5 as well. And I always steal Jackass's lighters. So I bought me some lighters just to have a collection of. And they look like this. So... That was like two dollars and then i got me some pink manila kiss perfume to wear after i get out of the beach and i'm just going to keep that in the diaper bag well my beach bag which i gotta get that set up because i gotta get my beach clothes and stuff and then for when we do go to the beach i bought her a little swimming suit and this was like 8.44 and this is 3T. So she should be able to fit this in a whole lot better. And that's the way when we actually get the pool set back up because we're taking the pool down until we get back. So she's got a little. I'll we'll be open. For what? Back store? Probably. So she's got a little bathing suit to wear in the pool and still just going in her diaper so that was everything that I bought at Walmart yesterday but yeah that is what we are doing right now is going to go get me some backer and some caffeine so I guess I will see you guys Probably tomorrow when we actually start going to my test and head now because I don't want to make the vlog two and a half hours long and not even upload. So yeah, I will see you guys in just a little while. By a little while, I mean tomorrow. Now it is 5.57. Last time I talked to you guys, it was 3.58. What's up with me in the 57? Hmm? So, we're actually taking the van to Mom's right now. Desi's driving the truck. Babe's driving the van. So, that's what we are doing right now. And this thing is still wobbly. It's not as wobbly. So yeah. I'm talking about 
in the video. Oh, in the video? Yeah. Oops. But you can hear the rain more. Or it's on the dash. I mean, look how wobbly. Good afternoon, everyone. So, it is currently Monday, June 15th at 12.42 p.m. Babe and Desi and them just now dropped me off here at the college so I can go for my testing. Sorry that, sorry that I didn't record this morning when we left or anything, we got everything packed up. I couldn't because I was too busy getting everything packed and everything. But I'm here at the college now. It is in the Good Pasture building, which is where I'm at now, and G101. So I will see you guys in just a second. It's down through here. G101. So, this is where I had to come one day to do my payroll. So, it's a long walk, I tell you that much. Flowers. They're pretty flowers. One thing I didn't bring was number two pencils. Okay, so now let's go and try to find G101. So apparently, here it is, G101A. But... There's nobody in there. Here it is. Okay, so now it is... It is 1.53 in the afternoon. I'm just not going to take in the test. I failed this one. It said that... I was supposed to score a 390 or above. My score was a 365. Like, like seriously, come on. I was trying. I had the majority of them correct. Like, I don't see what in the world made me fail. Like, like seriously. Come on. If you guys want to, you can pause it on that. If you guys want to, you can pause it. But I'm going to head on back out. And yeah, I am completely pissed off right now. I thought I actually done correct. I thought I got them everyone right. Safety and compliance number of items 25 below the passing standard. Patient precautions, preparations, 23. Routine blood collections, 30. Special collections, 7. And processing, 15. And it says I have two more chances to successfully pass the examination. There must be a minimum of 30 days between each attempt. And then candidates who are unsuccessful after three attempts will be required to wait one year before testing again. Oh, well. Can't say I'm not a CNA. I tried my best at it. It just hurts because all of my effort and everything that I just put into that test, it said I failed. It says status did not pass. 
the nursing aid test was easier than this. And I passed that with flying colors. I was supposed to score a 54. I scored a 50. I was scored, supposed to score a 52, and I was scored a 54. What, what would they would have done if I would have scored exactly a 52? Say I didn't pass. I need a chew. I need a vape. I need whatever. Yeah. You guys can tell I'm pissed off right now, but I'm going to go ahead out here to the truck so we can head on to Florida and maybe everything will get better. So I will see you guys in just a little while. from Ashland through Virginia and all them states so yeah I just thought I would give you guys an update this is our first stop to go pee and everything and change the babies so yeah I will see you guys with another update in a little while at our second stop
the departed the blog. So it is now currently nine o'clock at night. We just now got here in South Carolina. We are at our third stop for tonight. Sorry I didn't film the second stop, but I didn't take my phone into the gas station or anything because I had to get something to drink and we filled up on gas. So yeah, like I say, we are in South Carolina now. We still got like 500 and some miles left till we get there. So I will see you guys at our next stop. And if I don't record any more road clips, it's because it's getting dark and getting late. So yeah. So our, what, third, fourth stop? Third. Third stop of the night. It is currently 1045 at night. We had to stop and change the babies because a little bit pooped. <laughs> and my camera is really freaked up. It's more like moving by itself. But yeah, that is what we are doing. We had to go pee, so. Yo, Ratty? No, I'm going to be sick. But yeah, we'll see you guys in just a little while. Road trip. Walks back outside. Walk through the bathroom. Hey, what's up? What's hey, what's up? up? It's six, six. Speaking. Look at that sexiness. <laughs> oh. Don't do Jesus. It's just Michael. <laughs> Come here, buddy. And look at that truck in the light. Mama. Look at it. Mama, come get him. He's really <laughs> what? What me? Oh dear Jesus! I know I'm not going. <laughs> I got you anyways. What are you gonna do about it?
What? Take him up there. Sissy, no. I'm not good at this. I have you back up there off this thing with him. This thing moves too much.
welcome back to another part of the vlog. It is currently, what did I say it was? Wednesday, June 17th. It's the 10th to 16th. And it is 12.31 in the afternoon. We are going to storage. Just clean it out and get some things that Chris and Robin give us. So that's what we are doing right now. And we've actually been sitting here in traffic for about what? Five minutes. Just that. So much, yeah. And you can see the RHEC sticker perfectly right there. It's why I like the thing right there. Sorry I didn't film like actual part of the vlog like I am right now. But that's because yesterday morning when we got there, we got there at like what? 20 minutes to 7. 20 minutes to 7. And then we didn't go to sleep until like 3 o'clock yesterday afternoon. And we didn't even sleep that long. It was more like an hour nap. And then before we went to go take a nap, we went to the lake, rode the jet skis, had fun. So, and I actually got to drive the jet ski. I wasn't as nervous on the jet ski as I am like driving a vehicle, if that makes any sense. Because on the jet ski you've got the handlebars and in a vehicle you've got a steering wheel. I'm used to a steering wheel. But it was fun. And actually if I am thinking correctly, tonight we're going to clear water, but we're not fishing. I would love to go to Honeymoon Island before we go. Tomorrow? Me and you, we're taking Dad fishing. We got her talker bench hung up that we bought her the other day at Walmart. So, and she's actually sleeping in it good. She's sleeping in it better than what we actually thought she would, honestly. That's what we're doing right now. I thought I'd give you guys a little update since I ain't did an update since we was in South Carolina the other night. Well, technically yesterday morning. <laughs> so. Sometime yesterday. Sometime yesterday morning. Huh. Never noticed that about this stuff. Look at the roll, roll that his truck has. I like the way he's got the lights on the back bumper there. Yeah. It's not really the turn signal. The lights on the bottom of it flashes with the turn signal. I kind of like to have it possessed so you can see it more. Yeah. Oh, and I ordered some stuff from Redneck Nation. Again, you girls got to have up church stuff, obviously. I ordered me a tank top the other day. It says uh, Redneck Nation till the day I die. Then I ordered a sticker for the back glass. It said Redneck Nation. Hopefully it'll fit. We'll figure it out. And then last night I ordered uh, two shirts. It says Up Church. Or as you see on the bottom. Ordered a necklace to hang on the rearview mirror, and then I ordered another sticker for the truck. But I don't know if we'll put it on the truck or van. The fucking squad sticker. Oh, down here, my my bottom corner. Yeah, but I only spent like what thirty dollars on. I'm 
excited for those to come in because I want to actually wear my shirt. But yeah, I guess I'm going to flip you guys around to the back camera so you guys can see what we're seeing. Hello there. So it is currently like 151. Oh, we are just moving stuff around in storage, getting some things for the babies. I found this these two bracelets in a box. So that's what we're doing. And I thought I would just give you guys a little update on how things are going. I had to move the truck up a little ago and then back it up. That was fun. I'm not used to backing up. I'm just used to going straight. I'm not used to backing up or anything, but I had to move the truck up and then back it up just a little bit so we can put some stuff on the back of the truck. And we went and got Gatorade and water having a good time um, I don't know exactly what time tomorrow we're going to go to Honeymoon Island but I think tonight we're going to uh, Clearwater. water but yeah I will see you guys in a little while Today is currently Saturday, this is like April, June 20th, and it is 1210 in the afternoon, 1210. I can't see today, okay? I'm losing my mind. I can't solve it. But, say what we're, we're doing right now. We're going through the Skyway Bridge. We're going to the Skyway Bridge, which is what, five miles across the ocean? Five, seven, something like that. Five to seven miles across the ocean. So, we think, and like, like 200 foot above the ocean. So, we're only going to stay out there for like a couple hours. Sorry I haven't vlogged in a few days. I just ain't went nowhere. And he couldn't really vlog because he don't know how to work the doohickey that I have set up here. So he's been doing the Bubby Do List. So that's why that I haven't filmed in a few days. Except for when me and Robin was in the truck, but Robin went to the bathroom, so Bellway broke next signal. But I'm fixing to take a two. I just now got me a nice coffee from McDonald's. Pine. I'm gonna flip you guys over to the back camera here in a minute. Sorry with all of the road clips and shit that I've been putting music over it. That's because I've been listening to that like BG, Cold Ford, all of them, so I just ain't I don't feel like getting copyright. And actually I have my BG 
CD and right now the Devil Don't Sleep album in the radio right now. I'm hoping this vlog ain't like two hours long because if it is, I will take out some of the clips that I filmed before we started on our way. Like the least important clips. Uh, and it is 92 degrees today, so it is hot and sticky. Twain twacks. Now we're going to go play on the jet skis later. Yeah, and we're going to go play on the jet skis. I told you guys that I drove the jet ski. He's actually got his confidence built up on it, so now he's out there doing the same thing. Like the motorcycle. It's easy to do, but you just got to keep your balance on that more than walking. Oh, that's what it feels like to me. We're almost in Tampa. Because I got these flotation devices, and they're already lopsided, so I ain't got good balance with them anyways. Leave my flotation devices alone. Well, you ain't hardly been around your flotation devices in two days. Mom, I can't help <laughs> And I use my flotation devices since we went to the lake the other day. I can't help it. He, he's had me doing the bubby do list and I ain't been able to stay away. That's my fault now. Oh, I thought he was tapping you on the shoulder. Anyways, I am going to be using the selfie stick Day as well when we when we go to Clearwater because I don't want to use it right now. And I would recommend you don't use it. I get it over the bridge. I know. That's why I said right now. Talking about when we're there. Everyone want to do Chinese fire drill? I want some Chinese. Fire drill. You know what a Chinese fire drill is? What? Open the two doors. Matthew opens this door. We run around the truck until light turns down. Oh, that's also just a, a TikTok too. Yeah, we actually done it. <laughs> well, not on kids. that because if a retard did that. Facebook. No. Yeah. You and him at the lake. Retard. But yeah, I will see you guys in just a little bit. I'm going to flip you guys to the back camera because we're at a red light right now. So I will see you guys in the wall.
now we're going to go and get the jet skis and take them out. And then ride them for a little while. And then I guess later we're going to go to running the mountain. That's the plans for now. It says it's 89 degrees, but it feels like it's 189. It's supposed to be 92 today. Oh, well, that's 95. But I thought I'd give you guys a little update on what we're doing and if we caught anything. I guess I will see you guys when we uh, start heading to the lake to get the jet out. So I hate to end the vlog right here for you guys, but we came home, what was it, Tuesday or Wednesday? We got home Tuesday, but we got home, actually got home Wednesday morning. We, we started coming home Tuesday. And we got here at the house at 4 o'clock yesterday morning. So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Sorry if the vlog was like an hour long for you guys. And all I had done was ba basically blabbed and did road clips and stuff. But I want to go ahead and get this vlog ended and edited for you guys. And get it uploaded within this weekend. Because I have some good news coming up hopefully so yeah give it a big thumbs up go down and subscribe if you ain't already to become a member of my family and i will see you guys in my next one don't forget to turn on the little bell to be notified when i upload